Our service for God is not worth doing if it does not attract the attention of the enemy. If the enemy sees what we're doing and he is not intimidated, he is not worried about losing any souls through our ministry, he's not afraid that we are going to make an impact for Christ against the, the dark side, the kingdom of Satan, then our service needs to be readjusted, take it back to the studio, rewrite the blueprint. Uh, we need to be doing stuff that causes the enemy to flare up and come against us. So whether you're doing charity, you feel like God's leading you to do charity, are you receiving persecution? Because all who live godly in Christ shall suffer persecution. And to live godly means to be actively pursuing God's will in the earth for Christ, promoting Christ to the world promoting obedience to Christ, presenting Christ and His reconciliation to the Father, and living a holy, righteous life. So examine yourselves and make sure that you're being persecuted. Also be careful about being foolish and trying to be persecuted to make yourself feel like you're doing God's will. Being, uh, what's the word, annoying. Like if you're doing street preaching, being annoying is not going to help you um, against the enemy. That's going to work with the enemy. So you got to make sure you have a good reputation, that you're mature, you do things in an organized fashion, but that you, and you have a good way of saying what you say, a good way of presenting of presenting Christ properly in a, a way that really cuts to the heart of people and lets them know that Christ died for them and rose rose from the dead to live in them and that they have to turn from all their sins and forsake forsake their self guidance and submit to the guidance of Christ and um, that he wants to renew their soul give them a new heart a new mind new spirit and you know how to present Christ but uh make sure you're not doing something that doesn't even get the enemy worried about you um, also sometimes you might feel like you're being attacked by the devil but really you're being attacked by God God's at war with you because you're doing you're living a life that's not in his will and you're outside of his will you think because you're doing some good works maybe or something like that that God's all for you but you need to be doing godly works not good works you, you need to be serving Christ, lifting up Christ. If what you're doing is good works, but you don't talk about Christ, then you need to stop what you're doing and get right with God. All right? So I want to pray. Father, I just pray that those who watch this video, I pray that your spirit will search their hearts, rewrite their plan, give them clear direction so they know how to serve you properly and to glorify Christ and lift him up and draw all men unto you. Amen. In Jesus' name I pray. I pray that you'll show them if what they're doing is vain and show me what I'm if what I'm doing is vain. Help us to refine our ministries to make the greatest impact and to reap the largest harvest. Amen.